Kanye West finally introduced his daughter North to his new wife Bianca Sensory, and we're now hearing that North loves her new stepmom. However, Kanye's ex Kim Kardashian is not thrilled at all about Kanye, Bianca, and North hanging out together. And despite Kim recently claiming she's in her quiet girl era, fans think that she's now throwing shade at Bianca on Instagram because North is really happy about her dad's new wife. But how does Kanye feel about all of this? Since he introduced North to Bianca, does this mean Bianca is here to stay? Let's break it down. You're an amazing father. Amazing father. Appreciate that, bro. As you all probably know by now, Kanye West has a new wife, Bianca Sensory. And despite initial reports that the marriage is just a PR stunt, it looks like it's the real deal after all. Bianca has worked as an architectural designer at Yeezy since November 2020, and the news about Kanye and Bianca's marriage first broke out on January 13th. TMZ confirmed that Bianca and Kanye had a wedding ceremony, but they were unable to verify whether a marriage certificate was filed. However, one insider close to Kanye and Bianca later told Us Weekly that the marriage is very real to them. Bianca's family, who lives in Australia, also recently broke their silence on Bianca getting married to Kanye, and they're very happy about the news. One of Bianca's sisters, Angelina Sensory, revealed that Bianca's whole family is excited, while another relative, Alyssa Sensory, said she was super happy for both Bianca and Kanye. As for Bianca, not much is known about her personal life, and she is yet to publicly speak about her relationship with Kanye. Bianca's private Instagram account was recently deactivated, and it doesn't look like she's using any other social media platforms. One of Bianca's former colleagues, architect Joe Toscano, recently talked to the Sydney Morning Herald, and he described Bianca as talented, professional, and hardworking. So, by all accounts, it seems like Bianca wants to stay out of the spotlight as much as possible, and this means she's the complete opposite of Kim Kardashian, and not her copycat like a lot of people claim. And this could also be one of the reasons why Kanye felt comfortable introducing his oldest daughter, North, to Bianca. After taking a short hiatus from the public eye, Kanye was recently spotted out and about with Bianca on several occasions, and on January 27th, he and Bianca attended North's basketball game in LA. Kim, who brought Chloe's cheating ex Tristan Thompson to tag along, reportedly kept her distance from Kanye and his wife at the game. However, several sources later said that Kim was furious Kanye came with Bianca. But here's where the whole thing gets even messier. After the game, Kanye was involved in an incident with several paparazzi because they refused to stop recording him. Kanye repeatedly asked one female paparazzi to stop following him and recording when he was with his kids, but the woman refused to put her phone down. So Kanye snatched it from her and threw it into the street. Kim was later asked about the incident while leaving the game with North, and she snapped at the paparazzi, telling them not to talk to her about Kanye. Hey, what do you think about Kanye getting to one of the paparazzi's Do not talk to me about that. Sorry, Kim. It wasn't me. So as you can see, this incident once again made Kanye look crazy, while Kim came off as the stable protective one. However, many fans are now speculating that Kim set Kanye up to make it look like he calls drama at North's game by bringing Bianca, and here's why. First of all, North School Sierra Canyon must have a private entrance and exit because Kim and Kanye are not the only celebs whose children go there. In fact, people who are way more powerful and richer than the Kardashians have kids at Sierra Canyon, and yet you never see them being hounded by paparazzi. So, if Kim really wants to protect her children, why doesn't she do what the rest of those rich people do and use the private entrance? And then, it's also weird that Kim chose to bring Tristan with her to North's game, because she must have known this would draw even more attention from the paparazzi, considering all the recent drama with Tristan and Chloe. But there's an even bigger clue that Kanye's altercation with the paparazzi at North's game could have been a setup. See, the reason why Kanye got upset with the paparazzi is because one person who was filming him was extremely rude and made a very below the belt comment about Kanye not being able to see his kids at home. Take a look. What the? Oh, he threw his phone away. Do you want me to be running up on your kids' games like that? Hey, bro, what do you want me to do? Is everybody's here? Dude, you, you know how it is every week, bro. I want to just see my kids. I understand, bro, but it's not just me. It's a it's hundred of us. Everybody got to stop when I see my kids. Bro, how you, how, dude, like, what do you want us to do? It's a hundred of us. I don't care how many. Oh, well, what do you want us to do? Do you want to hear what I want you to do? Yeah, tell us what you want us to do. If I need to see my kids without oh. you photographing. Okay. You can't go home and see them? Like, what do you want us to do? It's a public place. It's called human rights. It's a public place.
Now, the fact that this man told Kanye you can't go home and see your kids is crazy because this is not how regular paparazzi talked to Kanye before he went public with Bianca. In fact, the paparazzi were very friendly with him and Kanye would always stop and chat with them. And this is exactly why many fans are now convinced that Kim tipped off these particular paparazzi at North's game and told them to antagonize Kanye. And if you're wondering why Kim would do that, well, it turns out that Kim can't stand that Kanye recently introduced Bianca to North and that North actually like spending time with Bianca. On Tuesday, January 21st, Kanye, Bianca, North, and one of North's friends had dinner together at Nobu in Malibu, California, and North seemed to be in great spirits throughout the night. But see, this outing came shortly after a source close to the Kardashians told Page Six that Kim and her family don't even believe Kanye's marriage is real, and they don't want Bianca hanging out with the kids until Kanye produces a marriage certificate. The insider also went on to say that the family isn't seeing this as a marriage yet, and and they are waiting to see if he files for papers. They're nervous because if it's real, she would be in the children's lives, the source added. Well, the fact that Bianca is now hanging out with North in public must mean that the marriage is real after all. And we're now hearing that Kim is losing it over North and Bianca's growing bond. Apparently, Kim can't handle that Kanye moved on because she thought he was still obsessed with her and would keep trying to get her back. On top of that, Kim reportedly didn't believe Kanye was serious about Bianca because he was previously linked to several women who were accused of being Kim K lookalikes, so she thought Bianca was just another wannabe. In fact, it looks like Kim still feels the same way because shortly after Kanye and Bianca had dinner with North, Kim took to her Instagram and shared a story that many fans interpreted as shade towards Bianca. Kim shared a clip of the Drake and 21 Savage track More M's to her IG stories with lyrics that read, put her skims on, now she's acting like Kim. Now, when it comes to Kanye introducing Bianca to North, most fans don't see anything wrong with this considering that Bianca is not just Kanye's girlfriend, but his wife. And plus, Bianca's been working at Yeezy for over two years, so North was probably already familiar with her. As for Kim's reaction, well, she literally let Pete Davidson tattoo her kids' initials on his neck, so fans think she doesn't really have a lot of high ground to stand on. One fan pointed out, at least Ye will only have his kids around the woman he calls his wife. He didn't have them around any of the other women he was dating. Kim let Pete around her kids way too fast. Come on now. I don't think anybody thought Pete would be the one, including Kim. And another person added, she has a problem with his new wife, but not her daughter sitting on a man's lap, a man she brought around her children immediately after their dad moved out? Wow. But now let's hear your thoughts on this. How do you feel about Kanye introducing North to Bianca? Let us know in the comments. And if you thought this drama was messy, don't miss out on this next video.